Mel Stiegel, you've been retired now for a while. Have mm -hmm. you had time to reflect on your wonderful career and how satisfying was it? Well, it was very satisfying. Uh, not just only what I did on the football field, but the friends I've made off the field, uh, uh, the achievements on and off the field. It, it was a great uh, 17 years professionally, and especially the 14 years I spent in Winnipeg. And uh, like I always tell guys, enjoy it. Enjoy every moment. Uh, don't let one moment pass you up. Let it be good or bad. Uh, soak it in because it goes by fast. You know, I can just remember when I first got up here and everything just went by like a flash, but I enjoyed it and uh, it's something I will truly treasure for the rest of my life. You bled Bomber Blue. You didn't ever win a championship. Has that clouded your remembrances of your career? Or is it still something you cherish? Oh, not at all. You know, uh, this, this is a team sport. And I knew when Milt Stiegel stepped on the field, uh, he gave everything he had. It was just unfortunate that I didn't get that great cup ring. But I knew every time after a game, uh, after practice, I could look in the mirror and say, uh, I'm a champion because I left everything on the field every single time. So, uh, you know, I would love to have 10 rings on, on every single finger. I would just love to have one. But that's, that, that, doesn't, that didn't happen. But uh, as far as saying uh, my career has been clouded or it's not a uh, uh, finish is it, it, definitely not the case. You know, I'm, I'm very happy with, with the way everything went. How's life been since retirement? It's, it's been good. You know, I've been spending time with the family, working with TSN, doing some training down in Atlanta. Uh, I think my wife is getting tired of me. When I get to leave and go to work in Toronto, I think she's kind of excited because we've never spent a year together, but now we're spending some time together. But, you know, it's fun. Uh, the boys love having me around. My son, Chase, keeps asking when I'm going back to Winnipeg and play football again. I have to tell him that I retire. But, you know, uh, I'm enjoying it. I was ready for the transition, and uh, it's just the next part of life, and I'm, and I'm very happy with what's going on now. Your greatest moment as a Blue Bomber? Uh, of course, the 100-yard the touchdown in Edmonton. Like I always say, not only the greatest football play in CFL history, but the greatest play in football history. It's just something that we remember for a long time. And uh, even the people on the other side of the ball, I talked to some of those guys, my good buddy Shannon Garrett, uh, he said that's his greatest moment uh, because of the way things went down. So uh, I would have to say that 100-yard that touchdown catch last-second play in Edmonton.